Hello guys, so today I wanted to talk about a YouTuber, um, he goes by the name of Jeff Tech. Now, I tend to, I, I've been t trying to stay away from the whole, um, talking about other YouTubers for views or whatever like that, because I never do that for views, first of all. And I don't want to be called out for something that I'm not doing. But, this YouTuber caught my eye recently while I was watching Vanos. Um, and the video that uh, caught my attention was uh, Colin Vanos Gaming, OMG, he actually answered. And if you guys don't know, it's obviously fake by the title, because it just doesn't make sense. <clears throat> now, I, I can't play anything, because I'm not going to get sued, but one of over a, a couple things, if you go to Jeff Chet's channel, he... <laughs> His video, his video views never have a single amount of, like, consistent amount of views. They always jump, depending on what the title of the name, like, what the title of the video is. Um, for example, the, the Vanoss Gaming one has 22,000, and his most recent one has 1,000. Um... So right off the bat, you can already tell this guy has so much, um, just so many, like, all his subscribers from clickbaiting, and he gets so much money from clickbaiting. Um, if you go to his videos, the, um, all the videos, uh, uh they all, they all have, like, either worth, like, a lot higher dislikes, or equal amount of likes of dislikes. Some videos have more likes. Uh, one thing, I do want to give credit where credit is due. Um, he did, um, he did actually say in the description that it's a skit and everything he says is for entertainment purposes only, but the problem with that is because it's not in the title, so it is still considered clickbait, because not only does he not say it, but he doesn't- not only does he not say it in the title, but he doesn't say it in the video either. He says a couple things so he can get more views and more likes and all that. He says- he- he asks- he says he's not gonna give away the phone number for Van Off Gaming, but he says that if he gets 10,000 likes, that he'll give out the phone number to a couple lucky subscribers. Um, so right then and there he's already giving false things for 10,000 likes. And mind you, this video was uploaded four days ago, it was 22,000 views, and only 1,000 likes. So he's not hitting that milestone, thankfully. Um, I don't know if I already said this, but this part bugs me. Um, he, Score. yeah, this, this is the first time I've seen my beautiful thing. Select now that view. bugs me because I hate when people are so unmodest like that, and so, uh, like, in love with themselves, um, that they say it. And he says it twice, one at the beginning of the video and one at the end of the video. And he also does that thing where he asks for likes before you even know what's going to happen, except half the people that actually have a brain know what's going to happen, because how does, how does anyone match? not know what's gonna happen with a title like that. He has emojis in the title and all of that just... <sighs> gross. Gross. Just gross, gross. It's completely gross. <laughs> it's gross, and I don't like it. Um... Like, first, I just don't want anybody to start getting hate, in quotes, to uh, Jeff Tech. Even though he does clickbait, um, one of the a video he uploaded five days ago was four out of five fail this intelligence test, and the thumbnail is four out of five can't see the square, and it's a red base with a black circle. Um, and you'll see that the more popular the viewer, like if he when his titles include like. <laughs> YouTuber's name in it, the more popular the YouTuber, the more 
successful the video and whether or not the video is legit or not. Um, whenever he makes a video on Dan TDM, his his views go goes up from fifteen thousand when he make but when he makes a video on your it's only at six thousand. Um, and you notice there's like a lot of his videos like he says I met Dan TDM eighteen thousand views. Um, calling Roman Atwood, OMG, Britney answered 44,000 views. It's double the amount of the famous gaming ones. Um, calling Guava Juice, OM OMFG, he actually answered 33,000 views. Calling Monk Markiplier, he actually answered. It's just, he does the same, same garbage. Um, and this... Um, uh, he got 130 views on the no blinking for 24 hours challenge, and if you look, um, they don't have, none of them have good lights. They're pretty much always tied with each other. It's not, it's not a fun time, and he really does, in fact, bug me, because he clickbait. And he does those cringy thumbnails, and he does those he does those things where he feels like it's okay for him to say um, do these clickbait things because it's in the title or something. And I talk about I, I don't like people like this. These are the type of people that just you, but they're like. It's just, it's just gross. Um, but like I said, don't go give me any hate to this guy. But honestly, I, I really hope this guy does see this video so he can change himself because it, I don't know his for his hundred and forty thousand subscribers. I, he has a personality, and some of his videos aren't completely terrible. So I, I guess I can see why. Select your he, um, I can see why people subscribe to him, but just stop, please. And if you, one thing I do want to point out is that he is pretty lazy in his work, though. He doesn't do much editing at all. His videos are very short, and there's not much editing involved in them. His thumbnails, and I kid you not when I say this, they consist of mainly three, well, four things, alright? Wow. Well, I'll just tell you what they consist of, right? An arrow, and there every time it's the same exact arrow, so that's already terrible. A red circle, a phone, and some famous person. Whether the famous person's on the phone or whatever, um, there's always like a famous person famous youtuber in his thing or a famous youtuber's logo or a singer looking at Ed Sheeran he called Ed Sheeran and the, then it's the Roblox youtuber and Santa Claus it's just <laughs> it's um oh and titles like this to Siri like Roblox most insane secret hidden feature of Siri. It, it, that, titles like that bug me because he never, it, it's just stuff that actually never happened. Um, yeah, sorry about the fact that I ranted about some guy for however long this is, but I, some people just need to be talked about. Um, and like I said, I just kind of hope that somebody shows him this video or something, whether he takes it, like, if he doesn't see it, whether he see, takes it seriously or not, but it, it's just pretty bad, to be honest with you. I, I don't like it at all. People like this just are the bane, the bane of YouTube. But, um, yeah, if you guys watching, um, 
This is technically my Overwatch video for the week. I'm sorry that I'm already not standing with the whole, um, the whole upload schedule I already said. Sometimes I got school, sometimes I don't really have time to make a video. Um, sometimes I have school, I always have school. Um, but I will be streaming, um, by the time this, up, this video uploads, probably Fight. when this video is actually uploaded. Yeah. I've already been streaming for a little bit, um, but I, I'm not too sure um, if I will be, but I'll tweet it out if it comes again. For those of you guys who don't follow me on Twitter, you should definitely do that because um, my Twitter account is where I... Um, where I put all of my information, like what, what, like when I upload a new video, when I'm gonna stream, etc. It's yeah. So um, yeah. Um, but uh, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, let me know in the comments below. If you guys don't know, I really don't like asking for likes. It's just pretty stupid. Um, but just tell me if you liked it, tell me what I can prove on, tell me what you guys want me to play. I'm saying a lot of words really fast. And, once again, I'm sorry for the upload schedule because I also said that my videos would be well edited and have an intro and an outro, maybe possibly, but that's just not my style. Uh, but yeah. Um, thank you for watching, and, uh, have a nice day.